Hey y'all, so we back, you know what I'm saying? Today we're going to be talking about <clears throat> the ego of individuals. Most of the time people are just lost, hurt souls, you know? Some people like the pain, you know, they like to sit in the pain of, you know, like sadness and sorrow. Honestly, me personally, I have that part of me, you know what I'm saying? In order to be happy, you have to be sad, you know? No one in life is just extremely happy for no reason. They've been through some things. You know what I'm saying? They've been through some things. Now, with the ego, ego is a dangerous thing, right? Depending on if you can control it or not, simple things like that. Some people's ego shapes their life to where they see themselves in a specific way. And I know how that feels because I've been there, right? I've been in that situation of, like, Thinking I was this certain person. Everything, all my characteristics, my attributes. But life is life. You know what I'm saying? That's why so many people are different. They got different egos. Some people are the same. Some people talk like this and some people don't. Like Some people grew up the same. You know what I'm saying? But that's besides the point. All I'm really trying to tell you is the people that run my ego, the people that will shun you, because their ego or the people that will make you feel type of way because their ego forgive them you know everybody has their own life and their life path and honestly it's not it's not your job to correct it but you could realize that if someone's coming at you differently someone's coming at you in certain type of ways they're coming at you sideways if they're trying to seem like the bigger person even though you know what I'm saying they're just trying to make themselves feel good okay and that's the thing. Like, you don't have to. You don't even have to react to that. Mm. <sighs> I had something I was gonna say, but then the train of thought just left my brain. Honestly, let me uh, put it like this: one plus one equals two, mathematically. Right. This is mathematical terms now. Now, if you put a one a pyramid, one, one, then three ones on the bottom. So it's one, three ones on the bottom, then it goes down two, right? Two right here, and it goes down to these two. You can see like four, four. Then the pyramid generally goes down lower, lower, and it increases, right? And then on the other half of the the triangle is the uh, or the pyramid is the bottom part of the pyramid, and it goes back down to one. And the middle is the biggest number. That's people protecting themselves in life. You know, the ones is their shield. And once you really get in there and see what they're about, some people are infinite. Some people are just cubicle. They just go to a certain number and degree. If you, if you get that, you get that. You know what I'm saying? <sighs> Put it in simpler terms. People will find ways. To make themselves feel better. Because a lot of the times. They don't want to see. And embrace themselves for the person that they truly are. So what I'm saying is. The ones that are infinite. Are the ones that can accept themselves. And the ones that are finite. The ones that. Can't see themselves for who they truly are. Don't hate them. Just, just accept the fact that. They're living in their own reality. Just like us. So nothing but love. You know what I'm saying? You can help them see it. You can help them not see it. Things like that. Also, update. Cut, like, comment, and subscribe. I've been working on fixing this car. I think it's really fucked. But stay tuned for that. Don't forget to subscribe. We on the come up. This is the Hanma family. Okay? That's what I decided to call us. The Hanmas. You know what I'm saying? Males, females, brothers, mothers, sisters, cousins, uncles, grandpas, children, babies. All that. We could be Hanmas. You know what I'm saying? That's, it's like that. You know what I'm saying? So don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.